Introduce the new SDS-1000 series of oscilloscopes created by Chinese manufacturer Cygland. We are going to tell you about the new SDS-1102 CML scope. Cygland company is the OEM manufacturer of LeCroy and A10 oscilloscopes. So, let's take a look inside the device package. It contains the following. The oscilloscope, which is packed in a protective frame made of durable foam for safe transportation. Both mass and size parameters of the device are standard for this class of devices. It is as compact and lightweight as possible. A pair of measuring probes with a set of markers and alignment screwdriver. Power cable. User manual. Software CD. And the USB cable. The device manufacturer did not invent the wheel and therefore the ergonomics of the oscilloscope is not much different from any representative of its class. The left side of the device houses the main input. The power button is located on the top of the oscilloscope. The back panel, Kensington lock, pass-fail output, RS-232 and USB interfaces. The manufacturer placed the following elements on the scope front panel, 7-inch display, input for the external storage device, controls, channel inputs and external trigger, the output for the calibration generator. Internals of the SDS-1000 series oscilloscopes can be characterized by careful assembly, convenient elements layout and a good overall impression about the quality. The oscilloscope was built on a modern platform which is used by the majority of measuring equipment manufacturers. It is based on Input ADC, Altera Cyclone FPGA, the so-called long memory, black fence signal processor made by analog devices, Unix RAM, NAND flash. Fifty volt ampere switching power supply powers all the components of this device. SDS-1000 series of oscilloscopes is presented with the 25 to 200 MHz bandwidth models. Sampling rate: 500 mega samples per second, up to 1 giga sample per second, and 5 kilobyte to 2 megabytes internal memory depth. Let's take a closer look at the functional features of this device. The first time you start up the oscilloscope, it is necessary to adjust the probe compensation. The set includes special screwdriver for this purpose. Horizontal and vertical system controls, user settings and navigation through the menu options are intuitive and easy to use. Even an inexperienced user can use the device owing to the built-in hints and handy menu. Oscilloscopes are nowadays often referred to as digital storage oscilloscopes. Let's see what this means in practice. You can save waveforms on the removal of storage drives, like USB flash drives with FAT32 file system. Save menu can be entered by pressing the Save Recall button. In a Type submenu, you can choose the format of saved waveforms and general device settings. Waveform menu items allow saving data in an internal system format. Files can be saved to the internal memory of the scope and external storage drive. Let's select the second option. You may assign any name to a file, but we will use the default one. Now we can save the same signal in the image format. 
the procedure and sequence of actions is the same. There is a possibility to save and recall the data as CSV file. Previously recorded signal can be accessed from both internal memory and an external one. To do so, press the recall button in the same menu. Open the DAV file. The displayed signal can be analyzed in detail. There is a method which greatly simplifies the process of saving. Print button may not only send the FAVE forms to a printer, but it also can be used to quickly save data to external memory in a selected format. The WAVE form must be saved in DMP format for printing. After the appropriate settings are made, WAVE form saving is performed by pressing a single button. Let's look at the data stored in a computer. Files are stored in the root folder by default. This is how the BMP file looks like. This is the CSV file. DAV is an internal format that can only be read by the oscilloscope. If saving is done using the print button, the folders in the root are created with the name corresponding to the selected format. The device comes with EasyScope software. Let's see what it may offer. Run the software and press the connect button. Pressing refresh button in WaveGraph submenu displays the waveform on the PC screen. This waveform can be saved. Wave data submenu allows viewing the waveform as a table. The submenu wave measure allows you to display data while working in pass fail mode. DSO bitmap menu allows you to save screenshots in BMP format. Also, the software allows you to remotely control all functions of the oscilloscope. At the same time, the control buttons on the scope are not blocked. Let's take a closer look at the Wave Graph submenu. As you can see, the waveform can be easily saved or displayed by performing simple operations. The screen can display up to five waveforms simultaneously, two captured signals and three previously saved.
We should also note the additional features of this device, such as digital filters, wide synchronization possibilities, math functions including fast Fourier transform. As a result, we should note that due to the overall specifications and consumer appeal, Cyclone SDS1000 series has the potential to become a bestseller among low-cost oscilloscopes.